DGP Bhaskar Jyoti Mohanta held a crucial meeting with all the parental bodies overseeing the functioning of madrasas in the state today. Now in the meeting held at police headquarters in Gohati, DGP Mohanta asked all bodies to furnish a detailed report of all the madrasas in Assam in the form of a printed document. Well, to tackle the jihadi threat, DGP Mohanta sought cooperation from the various organizations to identify such elements and ensure proper police verification. The DGP further said that the distance between madrasas should be at least 3 kilometers and each madrasa should ideally have at least 100 students. Well, this is the big story from Assam. DGP Bhaskar Jyoti Mohanta held a crucial meeting with all the parental bodies overseeing the functioning of madrasas in the state today. While the meeting held at the police headquarters in Gohati DGP Mohanta had asked all bodies to furnish a detailed report of all the madrasas in Assam in the form of a printed document. Now, to tackle the jihadi threat, DGP Mohanta sought cooperation from the various organizations to identify such elements and ensure proper police verification. The DGP further said that the distance between madrasas should be at least 3 kilometers and each madrasa should ideally have at least 100 students. And joining me live on the broadcast is our Chief of Bureau, Arindam Das. Arindam, first of all, what necessitated the meeting? And if you could give us details of some highlights from today's meeting. Yes, Aaron, this is a follow-up meeting of the DGP's meeting on September 4th with all the parental bodies overseeing the functioning of madrasas in Assam. That a follow-up meeting was held at the police headquarters in Guwahati today where the DGP has asked all the parental bodies overseeing the madrasas in Assam to submit a detailed list and the functioning of these madrasas, uh, the list of madrasas uh, that will be uh, given, how are they functioning by December 1 and that list would be uploaded in the portal of the police site. So definitely this is a big move to uh, tackle the jihadi threat related or uh, over, uh, engaged with the madrasas in Islam because we have seen that off late uh, several arrests have been made in madrasas where clerics from the madrasas have been arrested. These clerics uh, who came from outside the Sam, they were taking shelter in this madrasa and were engaged in spreading uh, jihadi activities or uh, spreading uh, radicalism in the state of Assam. So to tackle that threat, the uh, DGP has asked all the parental bodies to submit a detailed report by December 1 and that list would be uploaded. Secondly, the DGP has asked all the uh, organizations to uh, ensure that the setting up of madrasas, it should be within a radius of uh, 3 kilometers. That is, the distance between each madrasa should be 3 kilometers. So, and the third point that is uh, uh, been uh, communicated uh, to these organizations is that there should be at least 100 students in each madrasas. So, if uh, in some, some places, uh, some uh, madrasas comes up which does not have 100 or less students, that uh, madrasa should not be opened up. So, these are basically the main points uh, which are discussed in today's crucial meeting and this is basically to tackle the threat related uh, uh, to the madrasas which is related to jihadi activities in Assam. All right, well, the Assam police, they're on its toes to root out jihadi elements from the state. Our chief of bureau, Arindam Das, I appreciate it.